The Zika virus is a fairly known disease. It is, however, not very dangerous. It has milder symptoms than dengue or yellow fever. It is transmitted to people through the bite of an infected mosquito from the Iodes genus in tropical regions, and the symptoms normally last for two to seven days. First of all, few people only show symptoms, so that's, we see figures between 75-80%. That's not 100% clear because Zika, because it is so mild normally, is a fairly unknown disease. That's very important here. Yeah. So those who do show symptoms normally have a, typically show a fever, headache, a joint pain, and most distinctively um, a rash. So that the rash seems to be the most distinctive of, of the features. So right now, people presenting themselves with similar features uh, to, to their health uh, facilities would get uh, ticked off as uh, presumably uh, Zika infected. Because laboratory tested, we only have a few hundred. Agencies investigating the Zika outbreaks are finding an increasing body of evidence about the link between the virus and a condition of abnormally small heads in babies born. Other potential causes are also being investigated. The association between microcephaly and Zika so far is uh, mainly a circumstantial um, uh, association, uh, lab tested, laboratory tested only in about, I think, eight cases where either fetuses or uh, uh, dead babies or, uh, or, or mothers then were tested positive for the Zika virus. So laboratory confirmed we only have a handful of cases, but of course the huge increase of, of Zika especially in northeastern uh, Brazil, and the rise of Zika cases gives a lot of reason for concern. And now the, the big uh, task is to try to establish the link here. People sick with the Zika virus are recommended to take plenty of rest, drink enough fluids and treat pain and fever with common medicines. The virus outbreaks were first reported from the Pacific in 2007. In 2015, cases have been recorded from the Americas in Brazil and Colombia and Cape Verde in Africa. There is currently no vaccine available. Maria Galang, CCTV.